and welcome to DTW Test Prep. Welcome. So today we have a sad math question and it's on exponents. Now look at this question. It says if 2a minus b is equal to 4, what is the value of this? Okay, what is the value of 4a? It's a 4 to the power of a over 2 to the power of b. So what do you do? All right, so we have to simplify this in a way we have that we should have 2a minus b. Then now put um, the value of 2a minus b as 4. So let's simplify this. Now, look at this 4 here. 4 can be likened to 2 raised to the power of 2. Okay, you put it all in parentheses, a over 2b. Okay, you need to have your knowledge of your exponents, your rules of exponents, okay, before, you know, you can really handle this. All right? I will do... Uh, yeah, there's a video already on this channel that explains exponents in detail. Please do check that video, okay? So you have this now, then this will be equal to, you multiply a times this 2 here, it gives us what? 2 raised to the power 2a over 2b. And remember, when bases that are the same are divided, if the operation between bases are the same is division, you subtract their powers. Do you remember that law? When you have the base, which is 2 and 2 here, when they are now the same, okay, what do you do? You subtract their powers. The powers of the upper one is 2a, the power of the lower base is b, okay? So we have to simplify. That's why we have to change this 4 to 2, okay? So we have the same base. Now, we now have 2 raised to the power 2a, minus b do you see that the powers what you subtract the powers so that's what we have now so we have 2a raised to the power 2 2a and though we have 2 raised to the power 2a minus b so from here we know that 2a minus b is equal to 4 so all this is equal to 4 so we do 2 equal to 4 because we're told to look for the value so the value will be a number all right so 2 what is 2 raised to the power 4 that is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. And what would that give us? 2 times 2 is 4. 4 times 2 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16. So our answer here is 16. And what is the right option? Our right option is option C. Do you see that? All right. So thank you for staying tuned to the end of this video. You can please join our Facebook group. You can drop a picture of any math problems, um, your sad math problems, and you get solution. The link of the Facebook group is in the video description box of this video. Don't forget to subscribe. If you're interested in online tutoring, group tutoring for your SAT maths to prepare you for your test, okay, your digital uh, SAT test, do contact me, okay? And you can visit our website for other resources. All right, thank you. And finally, don't forget that Jesus Christ is coming soon. Please do give your life to Christ for he's the way, he's the truth, and he's the life. He's the one who's going to give you peace here on earth. Okay, you know, in any whatever situation you're going through, be it family situations, be it health challenges, financial challenges, Jesus can see you through that challenge. Please do come to him today and he will take that burden off you. Okay, and give you peace, joy, okay, and love. All right, come to Jesus today. You are destined to win in your forthcoming exams, SAT exams, and also in life. Take care.